Hey guys, I'm Brandon Gaylor, and I want to show you all my family's outdoor store. It's called Easy Troll Outdoors. We've actually been in business since 2014. Um, I want to show you around the store and kind of the history of how we started. So as you walk in the front door, to the left you'll have drinks and live bait, worms. The left side of our store we have clothing and like outdoor gear. The right side is all the fishing stuff. Right here by the door we have kayaks, some buff stuff. Right here's the register. We actually have some jackhammers and thunder crickets behind the register and some bull shads. We have spinning reels. And then around this side we have bait casters and some new stuff up here. Um, kayaks. Here's a GoPro display, which is what I'm filming with right now. Here's another kayak. That's actually what I have. It's a Feel Free Lure 11.5. This will sell three waters. Um, right here in the front, we have fishing rods. Mainly, we sell Dobbins, Lou's, and 13 fishing. And then as we go around the wall here, I'll show you how we have the store laid out. First we have spinner baits, then grubs. Here's some spinner bait trailers. Then you start your drop shot worms. We kind of go from smallest to largest as we go back. So here's some of the like finesse TRDs, more drop shot stuff. Um, centipedes, starting the shaky head worms and finesse worms right here. As we go, we get into the bigger, like magnum trick worms, then the Cinco type baits, the stick baits. Then you start getting into the, like the speed worms and worms with tails, um, U tail worms. Then ribbon top worms, and you, as you go this way, it gets bigger, all the way up to like the old monsters and the 12 inch worms and stuff like that. And the really big strike king worm, the bull worm. Then you start lizards, lizards right here, and their tubes. Over here, you have like your creature baits, like your brush hogs. Um, then you start your creature into crawl type baits, like your flipping type baits, your um, biffle bugs and rage crawls and stuff like that. This is all crawls here. Here's some spocket. Here's some like catfish bait and stuff like that. Then you start your line. We have braid for or braid full carbon the monofilament. Here's some mustad treble hooks, some spinnerbait blades and skirts. Then you start your trailers, like your crawl trailers, like for jigs. Then we start our jigs. And pure poison is a really famous jig company from our area in East Tennessee. They're pretty well known around here. And we have some like walleye type and sauger type stuff. Um, got a few tackle boxes. I'll take you back around and start on the aisles. On this end cap we have some like shaky head hooks and Ned rigs. And this is their hook section. Up top we have some live bait buckets, like minnow buckets. Here's some um, rod shields. Here's some bigger jig heads and magnum, or um, the big shaky heads. There's a fly rod. Here we have crappie section. It's all the crappie plastics right here. We're kind of low on that right now. It's not really crappie season. 
springtime. So I'm gonna really stock up on that and here's some gulp and power bait, like panfish baits and trout baits. On this end cap, we have our tungsten and we have the crappie jig heads. And on this side, we have floaters and terminal tackle and some sinkers. Up top, we have some flay knives and pliers and scales and floating lights, stuff like that. And then as we come around here, we set our top water. They got poppers, spooks, popper ploppers, then into jerk baits. Before that though, up top we have some boxes, tackle storage boxes. Okay, jerk baits. Then into frogs. We have everything from like the just plastic frogs and hollow body frogs and the tackle and booyah with the paddle tail frogs. There's some frog hooks. More frogs, then in the buzz baits, and then chatter baits. We're low on those right now, but usually have those pre stocked up well. Now around this side, we have a huge section of Strike King crankbaits. First off, there's rattle traps, then it starts to all Strike King pretty much. There's red eye shads, there's some booyah, uh, more red eye shads. Then we start with the smaller crankbaits here and get bigger as we go down. So now we're into like the 6XDs and stuff like that. All the way up to the 10XDs. And on this side, we have some blade baits and spoons. Right here is swim bait heads and hooks. There's some hair jigs, some rooster tails. Now we have just different brands of crankbaits. We have Storm, Berkeley, Mans, Spro, Bandits, and then Rapala. The Rapalas are some of my favorite. Then on here, this end cap, we have some more swim baits. And this section here is about half swim baits and half flukes. So first off, we have Kytec swim baits. Some missile and zoom. Then it turns into some flukes. And here's striking swim baits. Then the back, the very last room in the fishing side is back here. We have a power pole display with some blue water LED and the Russell Marine light on top. We have some nets up here. And over here we have a few de detailing supplies, Optimum No Rinse and Bass Boat Saver. You got your grit guard for your buckets and some ride company towels. There's some blue water LEDs and here's just some random boat parts. So as we go up back to the front of the store, there's actually a middle room, which has camping and kayak supplies. There's a few kayak supplies. Here is a feel free, feel free Dorado. Um, here's Enos and accessories, sleeping bags. There's an Eno swing or a chair swing and a tree pod. There's some winter clothes. There's some backpacks, more winter clothes. Then here is all kinds of camping and hiking supplies. Thank you.
There's some dive knives. Keep on your life jacket. As we come around, come out of the middle room into the other side of the store, we have clothing. It's good outdoor clothing. We have Marmot and Kavu, Mountain Khaki, United by Blue. Cool thing about United by Blue is for every item sold, they take a pound of trash out of America's waterways. Waterways. There's some United by Blue stuff. Marmot rain jackets, which are awesome. More marmot, marmot pants, marmot shirts. We have Kavu bags. So next up we have socks. We have Fox River and Darn Tough. And um, we have some Chaco and Kavu accessories. And right here we have our footwear section. We have Chacos. Then over in the back we have Keen and Jack Wolf skin. So here we have a Pretty big section of Chaco sandals. They're a great seller for us. And it's actually what I wear most of the time when it's warm enough. Um, we have a second rester here, which is not open right now. But here we have some Kavu bags and wallets and stuff. And then let me tell you all about the history of Easy Troll Outdoors and Easy Troll. Back in 2006, um, my dad's Rodney, he started Easy Tro, which originally was a recessed troll motor foot pedal tray for your boat. You just cut a hole in your boat and put that tray in and it makes the foot pedal of the tray or of the foot pedal of the troll motor recessed. We debuted that in 2006 at the FOW Cup. Um, and then for 12 years, we had that, plus we did some other products such as the Easy Troll Steps, which goes on your trailer frame. There's a tongue step and a side step. And we had a low profile butt seat, which it had a back on it. Um, we also have a utility tray, which goes in like your battery compartment. And you can just put whatever you want to in there, oil or tools or whatever. So in 12, for 12 years, from 06 to 2014, we had just that stuff. And it was made out of plastic, just like these kayaks are, polyethylene plastic. And we would sell them local, we'd go to trade shows, we traveled to FLW Cups, we traveled to Bassmaster Classics, ICAST, um, and local shows from Nashville, Knoxville, wherever. We're in East Tennessee, the Knoxville area. But, um, ICAST is what really helped us out. We went to ICAST in Orlando, Florida one year, and we actually started selling to Amazon and Tackle Warehouse. So that helped a lot. Um, but in 2014, we started Easy Troll Outdoors. And we started that in Oliver Springs, Tennessee. That was, it was maybe five, it was less than five minutes from our house. Is this in this, is in a little old store, not very good building, but that's how we started. We did that for a year, then we moved here where we are now in Harriman, Tennessee, in the Midtown area, right on Watts Bar Lake. And we've been, been doing that here since 2015. So it's going on four to five years right now. And we've brought in all the clothes stuff like I showed you and the hiking and camping stuff. Plus we still have all the fishing stuff. Um, we're trying to expand from that. Thanks for coming along on this tour of our store and our business with me. Um, if you want to know more about our business or more about the products we make or what we sell, just contact me, leave a comment below. Um, you can email my dad, is Rodney, it's R-O-D-N-E-Y at easytroll.com or you can go on our website, it's easytroll.com, E-Z-T-R-O-L-L.com. Thanks for watching and check back next time for more videos on our store and more fishing videos. Thanks guys.